June 2018. This former home haunt was shut down at the last minute last year because of neighbor complaints, problems with the city. Now it's back at a new location as a paying attraction in Griffith Park next to the ghost train. It's bigger, it's got more room, a little elbow room, room to breathe. Is it worth the $15 admission? We're going to find out. Come along with us if you dare. Welcome to Boney Island. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Come feast your eye sockets on the most colossal combination of calcified comedians ever collected. Inside, you'll experience the time of your life as our side-splitting skeletons have the time of their afterlife. Wander in wonderment as the antics of our hilarious haunters baffle and beguile you. Come witness their outlandish illusions and supernatural stratagems. Come stroll amongst multiple metaphysical manifestations of phenomenal flora and fauna, you know. Come stand before the mesmerizing maestro Maxilla as he plunges and conducts his choreographed cauldrons and jocular jack-o'-lanterns. Hurry, hurry, hurry! my video, sir? Yes, I sure am. So that's the new Boney Island. If you went to the home version, you're gonna recognize a lot of stuff, but not all of it. They haven't just spread things out. They filled the space with new attractions. There's the Deadwood Forest. There's the Boney Island Theater. So it really is a professional attraction. And even some of the familiar things, they're different. They've built stages. There's a wonderful facade for the Magic Cauldron Show. It really is a professional attraction now. Even if you are familiar with the old home version, you're gonna see new things. And I think you're gonna find that it's worth the price of admission. Oh wait, I just realized they're Snapdragon.